This is a robotic system for assisting a surgeon during neurosurgery operations. It's been designed for the insertion of instruments like biopsy probes or electrodes for deep brain stimulation through small holes in the head of the patient. It's a new kind of robot designed for some of the most delicate operations a surgeon can perform. It's accurate to just a few hundred microns and is far steadier than a surgeon's hand. And that's a big help. To maintain a specific orientation and avoid areas that could be just a few millimeters away from the one that you want to go through, a robot is certainly a lot more accurate. Neurosurgeon Francesco Cardinale is a specialist in epilepsy surgery. He helped the robot engineers at Politecnico di Milano understand what doctors really need. One of the system's innovative features is the feedback from the robot to the surgeon via the handheld controller. The surgeon can control the movements of the active robot using an instrument like this and at the same time receive feedback of the sensations that he would have operating directly on the brain. The robot feedback is amplified to help the surgeon feel his way around the brain. So what kind of operation could be performed with this type of robot? Drug-resistant epilepsy, Parkinson's and other motor skill problems like, for example, dystonia, chronic pain and all types of brain cancer. The robot developed within the EU's RoboCast project is a year away from surgical trials. In the meantime, the engineers are making it even smarter. The next step is to work on robots that have their own activity. For example, to compensate for the movement of the patient's head during an operation. As in surgical interventions on patients who remain awake. You are the first to test it.